Morning guys. Well, um, just taking delivery of these. This is the Detechnics W3 wire free uh, kit, uh, compatible with all them on there. Um, especially that one, the Nocta. I've got the Nocta Impact, and to be honest with you, I'm getting a bit fed up with uh, waiting for the headphones, so I thought I'd go out and buy these. These are the same um, gigahertz as the uh, the Nocta ones that are supposed to be coming out next month on the 15th, but I don't know, um, so I thought I'd get these. Right, um, I've seen other reviews, and they said that there's a, a very minimal lag and on here it says latency is 0 0.06 seconds um, but the technic said you you can't really miss you can't really notice it so I'll open the box and we'll see what we get inside it right this is what's inside the box all right you've got a few manuals there I have opened it before so that's why it's a bit of a mess um, you get your three you get your head jack you get your two rubber bands, micro USB to charge your transmitter, uh, USB cable to charge your headphones, some spare ear pads, and a hard case. And inside the hard case is your headphones. Right, there's your transmitter, and that weighs 33 grams. And there's your foldable headphones. Very simple. Click it. Click it into position. And then all you do is spin to your wearing position. Well, as I said a minute ago, uh, I'm using it on the uh, Nocta Impact. And uh, let's set it up and let's see how we go. Right, that's all you knocked on his no. <coughs> what we're going to do is plug it into the jack at the back. Now, the control box, it can go on a um, on the shaft. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do here. But I find in the back here, there's enough room to probably slip it in. It might be better on there with the, with the band, I don't know. Uh, but until I try it, <coughs> I'm going to keep it in there. So, what we'll do is we'll turn the unit on. One second, and you'll see a light flash. There you go. The light is flashing. And then, on the headphones, you press that button so you see this light flash. There you go, it's flashing now. There you go, it's flashing. And lay up head. That's it. Simple as that. So one warning people have been saying is do not put the headphones on before you turn the machine on because uh, if it's that loud, these are very, very loud headphones. So what we're going to do Turn the machine on. There you go. There you go. The sound is coming out of the headphones. So let's see what the uh, delay, if there is any. It's not... All right, this is the modern 5P. The noise you can hear is coming out of the headphones. So let's see what the legs like. Very sketchy signal this one. I'm gonna get another, I'm gonna get another one. Alright, that modern 5P was rubbish, so I'm gonna go with some stuff we actually find. If you've got beast detection, you're gonna find 20 Bs. So there is very, very minimal lag there. That's a 20p. 2p, 
Any bad signals? Very good. Right. Uh, that's a <coughs> an old Georgian penny. <laughs> well, I can't show any lag at the moment. Lead bag seals. Yeah. I'll go for one I found the other day. A noble coin weight. thumbs up at the moment um, doesn't seem to be any lag at all so these could be the answer um, I bought them from Detector Bits uh, very good price so go on his website and have a look uh, I ordered them in the afternoon on Friday by Saturday morning I had them so thumbs up for service there uh, once I've done a field test I'll let you know so for the time being happy hunting